What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Thomas with TMWYT. Here in my garage today, we have a returning car, the Scion FRS that we slammed on Raceland coilovers. This is Tristan's car right here, or Showcan visuals that you saw in the behind the scenes footage filming my car for Lee Tuner. As you can see, if you saw that video, his FRS was that cool orange color, and now it it's is- It's a Smurf. <laughs> it's a it's Smurf. It's a Smurf. <laughs> it's gloss light blue, Avery Denison, super nice wrap. Looks really good, turned out awesome, and it's still slammed, you already know. He's just balling out here. But he's done a couple of things. You see the rear diffuser that we deleted. He has a custom made rear diffuser back here, which looks super sweet as well as a new custom straight pipe back here. Very girthy, looks sweet. The car is coming together nicely here. We've got it posted up in the garage. We're doing another mod on it today. Um, I'm sorry I didn't get any footage of the wrap or making that cool diffuser. He did that kind of on his own time. But this is where the build at is right now. Today, what are we gonna be doing? We're gonna be installing these brand new headlights from Spec D Tuning. These are my absolutely, like, hands down favorite design headlights for this car. And I've always wanted um, a headlight of, of these for myself. But yeah, no, we're gonna throw this on the car. Um, and, and we're gonna get rid of these, these ugly ass stocks. Yeah, no, no ugly stuff. I think they're not like a bad looking headlight, but they're stocks. Yeah. These have got a cool uh, kind of white. Boomerang. Boomerang thing. So, so it's a more like boomerang it's style. always on light that looks very, very cool. We got the amber turn signal moved up into the center of the headlight and then the driving light does look very nice. Oh, also black housing, not chrome housing. It's gonna look a lot better, I think, with the blue. Um, and when he ends up going with black wheels for when we wide body the car, do the wide body, which will be coming to the channel very soon. You know we broke boys out here, so we gotta take a little bit more time to build Balling our car. <laughs> Balling on a budget, you're right. You already know. <laughs> he had to wrap the car himself. You're, but it still looks pretty great. Yeah, so we're gonna get these installed. It should be pretty simple. There's a couple little wiring things we have to do that we'll show you. We kind of have to tap into the stock wiring harness to get that little boomerang light that I showed you to work. Say hi to the golf. Hey golf. I like to cut meat. No. <laughs> we got she dirty right now, but we got some we got some stuff coming for her. I promise you guys, we got mods coming for this thing very soon. Also a new team elevate banner, because yeah. <laughs> Enough of that mucking around. We've already gotten the bumper disconnected as you can see. So we are going to pop out the stock headlights now and get ready to put in the new spec D's. So let's do it. So before you take off your front bumper, some people forget that there's a light right here. Make sure that you disconnect it. It's as easy as just twisting it and like, you know, putting it aside. Disconnect the side markers and disconnect the fog light bezel or your turn signal bezel. So don't just yeet your bumper off. Make sure you have everything disconnected before taking it off. And then we can get right into installing these headlights. Hi. Safety first, disconnect the battery. It's right over here in the corner. Disconnect the battery so you're not Go for a footage, guy. Get over it. But yeah, don't don't be zapping yourself while you're trying to put in the new headlights. Disconnect your battery. Be smart. Okay, so you're gonna have two bolts here. One of them is missing because I lost it. <laughs> nice. um, but really, all you need is one. So there's gonna be two bolts here. There's gonna be a bolt way in the heck in here. That's why I have this big old extension. So right there, you want to take that one out, and then there's a few bolts. One. Two, and then there should be a clip right here. So the clip, one, two, three, four, five bolts total on just the frame piece, which actually holds your headlight in. So like this will not come out unless th these are all unbolted. Here's our blinker harness stuff. So like this goes to the side marker, this goes to the blinker, and then this is the headlight module right here. So you have your brights and then your daytime running light. 
So here's kind of what we're looking at wiring wise from the spec D headlights. So we have the harness that plugs in that's gonna run your 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 actual light. light. Your actual headlight. And then to get your blinker, since the blinker on the FRS is down in the in the bumper in the fog light, um, we have two negatives and two positives. And one of these is a positive for the boomerang light, and one of these is a positive for the turn signal, which is moved to the headlight. So all we need to do is, uh, down here, here's your turn signal, this amber light right here. Um, we figured out that the yellow wire is going to be our amber turn signal, so the silver part of the headlight, and we are going to um, attach that to the existing turn signal harness on the car. We're gonna use butt connectors to um, tie in the new wires into the existing wiring harness on the FRS. These are a lifesaver when you're doing wiring on cars. And you can just file this to the side, meaning the trash can. All right, so we figured out this top left wire, this one right here, this white stripe with these two silver dashes far left on the connector over here is gonna be our positive. So we went and snipped that. Clean up all these little tiny wires, zip ties, electrical tape, and make it look OEM again so this is nice and clean. So we're gonna get that done really quick and then jump over to the other side. And then we will get back to you with a cinematic shot of Shokan's new headlights for the FRS. All right, we got the bumper all put on. Here's the first look of the front end all done up. They look super sweet. Love how they turned out. I think they look really, really good. I like how brand new they are. Cause I mean, you know, they're brand new. Oh yeah. But yeah, they look really, really good. Love the black housing. This ring is gonna look super sweet when it's actually on. Um, but yeah, these headlights turned out very cool. Definitely a good option if you have an FRS or BRZ. They're super sweet. Um, we're gonna finish getting everything buttoned up and then we'll jump into some cinematic footage of the new headlights.
right guys, and that's gonna wrap up today's video. I hope you enjoyed installing these new, what, what are they called? Uh, Spec D. Spec D headlights for Tristan Scion FRS back here. And that video was filmed and edited by me, not him. So <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll see how it goes. He's gonna, he's gonna give it a go as well, but I'm, I'm nowhere near as good as him. But <laughs> we try, we try. His car is looking super sweet though. We have tons more planned for this car. A little, little wide body action coming soon. And no, we're gonna get these reps out of here ASAP first. Bro, I figured out what wheels I'm getting. What wheels happening. Just, okay, you have to show me them off camera. Very big plans coming for this thing, so stay tuned if you're enjoying the FRS content. Kind of spicing it up in between my Volkswagen content. But if you like the look of these headlights, Make sure to pick them up. Link will be down in the description below. Car ID, pay from financing. Let's go. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, they look super good under the gas station lights. Shout out to the gas station. Always come through with the lights for my videos. What the hell? You can't steal that. Oh my God. Oh. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you leave a like down below and let us know what you think of the new headlights on Tristan's FRS. Love him, hate him. Leave it down below. Talk shit on him all you want. Go for it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll catch you in the next one.